classic play Canada has been transformed into the new musical A Minister's Wife, starring Tony nominees Mark Kudish and Bobby Steggert. We're at Lincoln Center Theatre to find out more about this new show. Give us a preview of this love triangle. Um, well, it's an adaptation of... George Bernard Shaw's Candida, um, adapted from the original by Austin Pendleton and Josh Schmidt and Jan Trannan. It's about a minister, a poet, and a wife, and all the exciting things happen that when you let a poet into your house, which is perhaps maybe that's the takeaway, don't let poets into your house. This poet comes in and just shakes up the entire house and I think forces everyone to look at um, their elephants in the room that they don't talk about and forces the truth to come out, forces people to grow, and change. It's, it's a really unique piece in that uh, it, it explores the George Bernard Shaw play but in a completely modern retelling and that uh, done by modern playwrights and modern directors and uh, mostly contemporary actors which has been uh, a really exciting experience but you're, you're getting an unusual take on a very old story. It was very long and very repressed and now we have tried to make the sex and the passion sing through the words. Describe this minister and his wife and their relationship. It's everybody's relationship. I mean, that's what's great about it, you know? That's why it's not the minister's wife. It's a minister's wife. Or we should say any minister's wife, any person's wife. It's any person's relationship. That's what I like about the show. How does it feel to have two Tony nominees vying for your love? <laughs> I can think of worse ways to spend my time, especially considering how uh, mean and unattractive they both are. What do you think of this musical? Tell us about the music. What's it like? Yeah, I saw um, The Adding Machine, you know, several years ago by Josh Schmidt um, and was so blown away by his really singular, unique voice as a composer. And um, he really weaves his work right into the fabric of the piece. I think there's so much emotion in the shop play underneath the surface and I think that this music really brings out that emotion so it gives the audience a different perspective than they would just seeing the play. What does the audience respond to with this piece? I think they respond to the humanity of it. They respond to the fact that you're seeing a man and his wife go through uh, a stage in their relationship that takes them both completely by surprise. And I think that's something that everybody can relate to. To me what the play says is you can't tell a woman to choose. I don't think you could maybe tell a man either, but we'll leave that out. You can't tell a woman to choose. Great thing is I feel like no one is wrong in this play. Everyone, you know, has their points, especially in the preaching match between Morel and Marchbanks. I feel like they're both right in their in their ways. Who should the minister's wife choose is perhaps the question of the evening. And, and maybe that's the tension that you bring into the theater with you and hopefully the one that we manage to hold you all the way through to the end of the play with. Mm -hmm.